Right. So, start all the way from the top. What's going on, folks? It's your boy coming to you live from another beautiful day here in paradise. And I am currently on my way to a meeting, on my way to a meeting with a new potential client for Mountain Air Productions. Not really gonna give y'all too much right here on my way there. Cause don't really know, don't know what he's looking for. Don't know if we're gonna be able to work together. There's just a whole lot of don't know floating around in the universe at the current moment. But I am hopeful and optimistic for the uh, Mountain Air Productions obtaining new projects, new clients. I know the money's coming. I know the work is coming. I'm just not 100% sure if this is going to be one of those. I don't know if it's gonna be the tip of that new wave or not, so who knows, we'll see. I've got high hopes for it, but I'm being realistic about it that it's gonna take me some trial and error. It's gonna take some no's before I start getting my yeses. So with all this being said, folks, I'm gonna hop off this camera and I'm gonna finish getting myself in the right headspace so I, so I can conquer this fucking meeting like a boss so <laughs> with uh that being said i'll catch y'all down the road what up folks so meeting this morning went well technically could have gone better but i'm not complaining we bet we both definitely left we, we, we had uh, constructive and positive conversations i feel like we both left Optimis optimistic about the future and excited so it was a good day but technically could have gone better I could have signed it like what I'm saying is like really we could have signed a contract this morning and I could have left with a stack of money in my hand but we're not at that stage he's not at that stage it's more of a more of a consultation about the future type situation but like I said things are looking good and I'm excited for my business and for his really um I want to see him win so even if it doesn't include me I'd, I'd like to see him win so now I'm posted up outside the gym about to go in here and hit legs and then I'll be I gotta run to the Dollar General quick and get Drea some some cold and flu medicine and yeah and then I'm gonna eat me a big ass meal tonight probably drink me a couple PBRs and call it a night not a whole lot probably gonna edit probably gonna edit you know the usual the usual Saturday night grind so with that being said folks I'm gonna keep this short and sweet and I'm gonna get in here don't mind my clearance ghosts in a can you boys got to do what you boys got to do but i'm gonna go in here get this leg day try to get y'all a couple clips and we're gonna call it
All right, folks. So we got another leg day in the books. And uh, to be honest, I totally missed out on recording. Uh, I, I totally missed out on recording like my last two supersets of the goblet squats with stiff leg deadlifts. And then I also triple setted those last two sets with uh, some laid back calf raises in the leg press machine, free weight leg press machine. Uh, y'all seen it in some of my other videos and whatnot, so y'all know what I'm talking about. But just sat down and did two sets of, uh, two sets of 20 at to do my last two sets of goblet squats and stiff leg deadlifts with, uh, with, it was a triple set. I'm sorry, I, I just did legs and my blood is all below my waist. <laughs> in my legs and my quads and my hamstrings and my calves are all pumped. And I can't quite think straight, but I'm still here recording this video and driving my ass to pick up some food and then head back to the house. So as far as the food goes, I'm on my way to local spot, Thai Cafe. It speaks for itself. I'm gonna be getting, uh, I got an order of sesame chicken with a uh, double order of rice. The, the portion of chicken is actually a very healthy portion of chicken. It's just the rice isn't enough always. So I went ahead and doubled up my order of rice so I could just go to ham on that rice and not worry about it um, and really what I'm prob I might do depending on the t I mean like I said the chickens usually a healthy portion and since I got a double order of rice I might be able to split it into two meals eat one real quick eat one of the portions of rice then split the chicken in half and then about an hour hour and a half eat again and eat it all by doing that but I'm about to pull in the parking lot down here and Hell yeah, it's packed. Between El Aguavera and Tower Cafe and the new gym in town work out anytime. This parking lot's packed. Not to mention the small handful of people that are at Roses. Lowe's Foods down there at the very end. Yep, it's a busy busy Saturday night here in Mount Airy. It's been good weather today too. It's been like real good and warm, real comfortable for a mid-December day. So anyways, about to head in here, get this food, and then run by the store and grab some drinks, and then head it to the house. So yeah, I'll catch y'all down the road.